because they understand when we go back to one man having one wife, you men, if you lay with that woman, marry her. If you have children with her, take care of them children. Raise them up. You men, don't shave your beard. You men, where, where, you, where your beard? That's where your protection lies. You men, take care of your own. Because the white man, the white woman, they don't give a damn about us. That's right. We over here caring about what's going on with them. Stop it. Because they ain't going to sleep thinking about, I wonder what's going on with the black race tonight. They ain't doing that. That's right. What we need to do is come back to each other what? as a people. The so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. We have to come together as a people and separate from them people. That's right. But it's hard to do that when you got sisters that don't have a man to go to. Once a great nation, but we lost it. Why did we lose it? Hosea chapter 4, verse 6. We lost it because we lost our way from this. Read. This is the book of Hosea, chapter 4, verse 6. Because a lot of us think the white man wrote this book. Ain't no white man wrote this Bible. This Bible was written by black men. You read it all through the Bible. Hair like wool, skin as black, bronze, colored. All that is in the Bible. Read. My people. So oh. God is possessive. He said, my people, you so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, read. My people are destroyed. Our people are destroyed. Be honest. When you look around and see the so-called black man and woman, do you think we destroyed? Do we look destroyed? We look trodden and beaten down. Half of us nodding off, falling asleep off the fentanyl right now. Half of us drunk, walking around the street staggered. A lot of us messed up out here. Why are we destroyed as the people, read? For lack. Oh, knowledge! We are destroyed because we don't have knowledge of who we are. We don't know who our God is. Where's our safety at? We don't have no safety in this place. You can't run to the police because as soon as you run and get help, I'm going to tell you an example for me. I got my car broken into. I called the police. They come through down guns on us. We like, wait, we called you. Get back on the street. Step back. I'm hold on. I'm the one that called you. My car got broken into. We need help. Get back. Guns are blazing. What, 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 what? We got no safety around here. You can't go to the white man for your safety because he ain't your people. He right. know that. The white man take care of his own. The white man going to give his son that job. He going to give his nephew that job. We don't do that for each other, though. We look at each other with the evil eyes and we talk about we got to take care of everybody. Everybody ain't thinking about us. Bring it out. Everybody ain't caring about what we going through. Oh, what's going, what about what's going on in West Ukraine? I don't give a damn about it. Because my people over here dying in the streets of Chicago. Bring it out. To hell with Russia. To hell with Ukraine. All of them. They ain't mine. These people on these streets, they mine. That's right. Read. My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. And God said the same thing. My people. Let's see what that knowledge is. Give me knowledge. Read. Malachi 2 and 7. So we, God said that we are destroyed because we lack knowledge as a people. We don't know our identity. We don't know where our safety. Where does our power come from? Where does our strength lie at? Where is our protection? Read. For the priest's lips should keep knowledge. So the priests should be the leaders of the nation. Meaning what? If I'm going through troubles in my marriage, I should be able to come to the leaders. Like, man, me and my wife, we going at it. That's how I got my brothers now. I'm going through trials. I come to my brothers like, man, bro, there's a lot of stuff going on. How can I get help? How do I fix this? The Bible says the priest's lips. My sister, do you got a man that you can go to if you need help? No. Why is that like that nowadays, Chris? We got a sister that says she don't have a man that she can go to for help. I see a lot of wealthy black men. I see a lot of black men with, with so-called power. So why do we have a black woman out here that feel like she don't got a black man to go to? A lot of men, a lot of our men has been tricked and manipulated by white supremacy. I like that. They hate themselves. They hate themselves. They they Bruh, man. he hit it right on the head. Self-destruction at the end of the day. My sister, bear with us. We, we getting back on our feet. Bear with us. We getting back on our feet. Read. For the priest lips should keep knowledge. So the priests should be the ones that you can go to when you need help. Read. And they should seek the law. The what? The law. So the Bible says my people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge. The Bible says the priest lips should what? Keep knowledge. And Let's they, see what that knowledge is. Read. And they should seek the law at his mouth. The law is where our power comes from. That's right. That's why they separate us from this Bible. Because they understand when we go back to one man having one wife, you men, if you lay with that woman, marry her. If you have children with her, take care of them children. Raise them up. You men, don't shave your beard. You men, 
Where, where, you, where you been? That's where your protection lies. You men, take care of your own. Because the white man, the white woman, they don't give a damn about us. That's right. We over here caring about what's going on with them. Stop it. Because they ain't going to sleep thinking about, I wonder what's going on with the black race tonight. They ain't doing that. That's right. What we need to do is come back to each other. What? As a people. The so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. We have to come together as a people and separate from them people. That's right. But it's hard to do that when you got sisters that don't have a man to go to. And we understand, sis. That's why you need to get up under your brothers. Your safety lies amongst your people. God <laughs> said, my God says, my people are destroyed for my brother. You was over here early. I got a question for you. Come on, boy. I got a question. What's your name again? Trey. Tracy? Trey. Trey? So check it out, Trey. We got a sister right here that says she don't feel like she got a black man that she can go to for help. You a black man? Are you a black man? You failing your people. I'm what you gonna baby. do about it? I don't call myself black. I call myself mother. Baby. Are you a man? Yes, sir. What are you doing to help protect your people? Nothing. Nothing. Really so how do you sleep good at night doing that? I just try to protect myself nowadays. So it's 94 and 16, and that's the problem that we have. We don't care about each other. Hey, what's that, the love wax code? That what's we that, Matthew, the love wax code? Ain't nobody gonna love us until we love ourselves. Give uh, me that Matthew 24 and 12. You say yeah. what? I say, ain't nobody love you until you love yourself. Man, stop worrying about loving people. Else. We need to learn to love each other. But you can't love each other until you love yourself. You don't love yourself. Just like everybody hate black people. Black people hate black people. If you don't love yourself, until we treat each other better. So you gonna go jump off the bridge then? Because the person that don't love themselves, they wouldn't even. Man, it's headshots. Boom. Hey, I'm out of here. No matter what you think love is, everybody got to love. Check this out. Read. I'm gonna show you what the book says. Watch this. Watch this. the book of Matthew, chapter 24 and verse 12. Watch this. And because iniquity shall abound. The love of many shall wax cold. So God says what? And because iniquity shall abound. That's the sign of judgment in the black community. Every five minutes a siren going on. So God says because what? Because iniquity. My brother, what's iniquity? What's, I, I, I can respect that. Sin. He hit it right on the head. Sin is iniquity. So God says because sin what? Shall abound. The love of many shall wax cold. Because sin is found all throughout the black community. You got whoremongering, you got transsexual, you got homosexuality, you got lying, you got stealing, you got thieving, you got murder. All this is found in the black community. If I want drugs, go to the black community. God says because sin is all through you guys, read. The love of many shall wax cold. That's what caused the love to go away. Because it's sin. Because the Bible says you should love your neighbor as you love yourself. If we got back to the laws of God, we'd be, hey, my brother, hey, my brother, I got a question for you. You a black man? We got a black sister right here that says she don't feel like she can know a man that can be there for her. She don't feel safe amongst her brother. She don't feel like it's black man to go to for protection. How you sleep good at night? You ain't even thinking, man, fuck him, huh? Uh, come over here and build with me, bro. Build. Just two minutes. Come build with me. Man, it ain't that important. We got a sister out here that don't feel like she got men that care about her. And you as a brother should care about your sister. Look at the princess. These is our people. This is the family. So how are we okay with her not having nobody to go to and you being okay with that? What you mean? She, she need men to step up and be men again. That's right. She need us to return back to this so we can get our strength back. Get the laws God. of God. Right. We That's need the right. most high to come back nigh unto us so we can get set up as the leaders and bring back the nation. But it ain't going to happen. You know why? Because we so caught up in the world. Oh, I got to go do this. I got to go do that. It's the seventh day. You're supposed to be resting. Read. Watch this. And because iniquity shall abound, the love of many shall work gold. So God says because sin is found all throughout the black community. Because if I was to ask your race, what would you tell me? Right. Black. Black is just the color your skin is brown. What's your race? Africa. Name that the white man, Leo Scipio's Africanus. What is your race? You see where I'm going? Melanated. There's so much community. Melanin don't mean nothing. Melanated. You got black. You got melanated. You got African. You got African American. None of it makes sense. It's all confusing. When you look at our race, we are the no. children of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Hey, come check the sign they out. Just the sign. Hey, bro, what's your name? Race. Come check the sign race, out right here. Races will cause confusion. Either you melanated or you not. We cool right? with that. We it's want all the confusion if that's what it is. Either you melanated or you not. So and because of iniquity, it ain't about melanin. It's about what's your father's race. 
If you look on that side, the so-called Mexicans, Dominicans, Puerto Ricans, Haitians, Jamaicans, African Americans, we were once a great nation on this earth. But when we separated, that's when we lost it. Why do we lose it? Read that from the top. And because of iniquity, because of what? And because of iniquity, you know what iniquity is? Iniquity is sin. God gave us commandments. The Bible wasn't written by the white man, it was written by the black man. God gave us commandments. Thou shalt not kill. Thou shalt not steal. Thou shalt. If you lay with a woman, you marry that woman. Love your people as you love yourself. These are the laws God gave us. We decided to cast the Bible off, and I'm going to do what I want to do with what the white man tell me. And God said, Because you do that, read. And because of iniquity shall abound. The love of many shall waste gold. There ain't no love amongst us. That's why we can have a daughter out here and be okay with her struggling. That's why we can have a brother out here and be okay with him struggling. That's why we can have our people sleeping on the streets at night and we go to sleep in our bed comfortable. Psalm 94 16. So the question I want to ask you now is what are you willing to do about it? Do you care? I'm gonna, before you answer, I'm going to show you what God said. Read. This is the book of Psalms, chapter 94 and verse 16. So this is the message to you so-called black men. Read. Who will rise up for me against the evildoers? Read it again. Who will rise up for me against the evildoers? So God is asking you so-called blacks, you so-called Hispanics, and you so-called Native American men, who is going to rise up for their people? Which one of you are going to raise up and take care of your daughters, your mothers, your fathers? Who's going to do it? That's what we out here doing now. That's right. We return it to our father, the most high God. Those people ain't no Jews. You know what, bro? Your father's so-called African-American. You're a Jew by blood. That's why they want to kill Kanye West, because he was telling the truth. He told the truth to the black man. You ain't a nigga. You ain't African-American. They took our history, they took our land, they took our name, they took everything from us and gave us chains. They gave us this, a beaten back. They gave us slavery and they took our identity. Bring it up. What God is doing, he bringing his Bible back out and he returning our identity to us. Our identity is our strength. That's right. And because we don't have our identity meaning these laws, we weak as a people. That's why our sister can be out here struggling and we ain't able to, my sister, my sister with the black hat, my you. You got two minutes for your brother? And that's what we turned into as a nation. Because when we came over here and changed, we cleaved to each other. We loved each other. Right. Once upon a time, our women needed us. But can you be mad at them the way we move as a people? No. Can you be mad at them? We want to be whores. We want to be liars, adulterers. We want to nail everything with a hole, man or a woman. We destroy it as a people. So Bring what do we got to do? Psalms 94 verse 16. Who will rise up? For me. We gotta rise up, stand up on your feet, get a backbone about yourself and be a man. That's Go right. through your struggles as a man. Don't bow down, don't fold. Stand stiff on the laws of God. That's Read. right. Who will rise up for me against the evildoers? You know who the evildoers is? You know who the evildoers is? Psalms 90, I mean, Job 90, 90 24. Who do you think are the evildoers? Edomites. Who? The white supremacists. The white supremacists and the Edomites. Why would you say that they're the evildoers? I mean, the most high prophesied they commanded. No, give me yeah, tangible things. What's some, some of the things they do? What's some of the things they do? Lynchings, kidnappings. They still doing that. Right. You know I mean? And uh, that's what we got to do. Like I just told you, when we it, came over here and changed, we right. loved each other. These people taught us to hate each other and that Jesus was white. Right. That's we were turning right. the truth back to our people. Give me Matthew, Job 9, 24 real quick, then we out of here. This is the book of Job, chapter 9 and verse 24. Read. The earth is given into the hands of the wicked. God said the earth is given to the hands of the wicked. Who rules the earth right now? Who got all the power in her? Who is that? Who is that? Who is that? I want to hear him say, who is that? What are the race of those people? Europeans, the white man. The white, you can say it, the white man. We're going to go far as the Chinese man, the, the Arab man. If you ain't an Israelite, you're against God and us. That's right. What is nation? Nation is family. Nation is community. Nation is men leading by example. Nation is women's support. Nation is children with role models. 